Yo, 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 what's going on guys, your boy Spilet 2K7 back with another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. In this video we'll be playing some more LSPDFR Coastal Callouts, which is still in open beta. It's a callout pack developed by PNW Parks fan. And if you guys like what you see, definitely check out the work in progress page down below. And if you'd like to try it out before it is released to the public, check out the Parks Benefactor program down below as well. So here guys, we have our Chevy Silverado pickup truck and we have a two defender class boat these are the 25 foot boats here and if you look on top we have a mounted machine gun so parks added in that it is static so we can't use it it is a little tricky to have working um guns on boats but um very 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 cool so we have a static machine gun and then the second update if you look around the back Look at that flag, boys! It is waving in the wind. Look at that. That is awesome. So in this video, as you can see, I'm going to be showing you some of the updates to the um, the boat models that Parks release uh, actually today. So let's go ahead and check them out here. Damn traffic. I'm going to just turn off traffic for a sec because I want to I wanna walk in the street. Looks better from out here. Alright, there we go. Alright, so look how awesome that one looks there. And we also have the traditional colors on this one as well. So as you see, it also has the um, mounted machine gun on front. And I've seen these um, boats in real life in New York City a couple times. They look so cool. And they actually do patrol with that same machine gun right there ready to deploy it if they have to, which is pretty cool. And um, also... Again, the flag is looking amazing, loving that. So we're going to go ahead and take one of these boats out on the open water and try it out and try out the new updates, see how it is. We also have a response boat medium, guys. Now, this one is huge, but this is just a medium-sized boat. This is an even bigger one. But this is a response boat medium. It's 45 feet, and it also has a machine gun up top as well pretty cool and it also has the flag update as well this one has two flags so we're rocking the american flag and the coast guard flag which is pretty cool so let me know what you guys think about that update i think it's awesome and shout out to pnw parks fan for um adding that into the dlc update all right so let's start getting some of these boats into the border um everything that we're doing right now is all part of coastal call outs putting the boats on the trailers we can actually launch them into the water so i will show you guys that we're going to launch each one we're going to set up the um coast guard dock station right over here so let's head over to the station and somebody was asking me yesterday the stations all come with coastal call outs as well so it does come with all of that so as you see united states coast guard United States Coast Guard. That looks really nice right there, actually. Screenshot. <laughs> All right, so we already have this is a larger boat over there. That's the um, Motor Life boat, and that's a 47 uh, foot boat. I don't know why I keep saying foot and feet. Uh, <laughs> I just keep switching. First we said foot, then we said feet. Now we're back to foot. I don't know. All right, so we're here at the station. This station does support helicopters. Holy crap, as well as boats. It will be nice if we don't knock down those um, lights there. So let's go ahead and start launching some of these um, boats into the water. Here. And um, the Defender boats normally stays on this side. So let's launch this into the water. We'll spin around and we'll have this ready to be set up. Alright. It's definitely one of my favorite parts of the mod. This is actually one of the first things I did when I first tried out Coastal Callouts was um, launch the boat into the... Yeah, I swear, can I ever avoid not getting soaked in what? Let me know, guys. How many times have you guys watched me play Coastal Callouts? Like, literally every time we end up getting soaking away it's pretty crazy another cool addition to the boat you can also open the doors on the side which is pretty cool as well all right so let's go ahead and get in also have lights and sirens as you can see there too very 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 cool all right so let's reposition this boat here So it looks like we have a pretty full dock already. Let's um, go ahead and anchor this one up front. Let me know which Defender boat you guys like better too. Do you guys like the gray one or do you guys like the traditional orange color one? Let me know 
in the description down below. So we're going to open this up, go into our boat menu, we're going to go ahead and store our boat. So this is going to anchor and keeps it here even if we leave the area, which is what we want because we are going to be leaving the area in a second. Alright, so let's go ahead and park up this trailer and let's go grab the rest of the boats there. Let's see, let's park up the trailers in front of this garage here, it should be fine. As you can see there are other Coast Guard members hanging around this station which is pretty cool. I actually saw a guy eating a donut um, by the docks early, it was pretty cool. So we'll leave this one right over here and let's um, head back over and grab the next one. Alright guys, so we are going to go ahead and grab the next one here. So this is the same boat, just a different uh, livery on it, different texture. Let's go ahead and deploy this one into the water. We got that flag flapping around though. Very, very cool update. Very, very cool. Alright, so let's go ahead and get this one in here. Whoops. Perfect dupe. And we'll go ahead and turn it over here. And we'll back this one into the water as well. Let's look out for the lights this time. Yeah, every time we leave, it does reload in more boats. It's part of the scripts files there, and the meta files, so it's all good. We're just going to have a abundance of boats today, no problem. Alright, so let's drop this one into the water. Wait, where did that trailer come from? That trailer wasn't just there, was it? Did I leave that there from earlier? I'm confused. Alright, let's drop this one into the water. It's pretty much an automatic process as soon as you roll back it drops out and we can also put them back onto the trailer as well which is pretty cool. Let's go ahead and get on this one. Love that machine gun though, that's going to look awesome. Alright, let's uh, park this one over there. The, the responsible medium we normally put over on the other side but I may have to put it on this side since there's no space over there. Also guys, let me know, what's your favorite boat so far? Do you guys like the Defender boat, which is the one I'm currently driving? Do you guys like the Response boat Medium, which is going to be the next one we're loading in? Or do you guys like the, the, um, the, uh, 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 uh Motor Life boat, which is the largest one so far? Also, I'm looking forward to the bigger boats, which will eventually come probably after Coastal Callouts is released, since it's just going to take so long to finish up the bigger boats but the coast guard cutters those are gonna be awesome can't wait to be able to land a helicopter on one of those that should be a lot of fun all right so let's store this one too and let's go ahead and wait did i i was gonna say the truck disappear all right so we got one more boat to go ahead and load up guys and once we load them up i think i'm gonna take the defender out on the water and we'll do like a little patrol or something oh my god it's a drunk coast guard man you guys see that? Oh man. Alright, let's park this over here. Turned a little too much. Love these trailers, so. Alright, we'll park this one up right here. We'll turn off our lights. Alright, perfect. Alright, so let's go grab that last one that's on the tractor trailer and we will bring it over here. Hopefully it gets a little bit more sunny. This uh, overcast isn't best weather, but eh, let's see what happens. Alright guys, so this is the motor lifeboat. I'm sorry, this is a response boat medium, excuse me there. So let's go ahead and get this one into the water. We can also use this trailer for the motor lifeboat as well. So we can also spawn the motor lifeboat on this trailer. Alright, so let's go ahead and put this one into the water. This thing is really huge when you take that take it out of the water. Gonna have to kind of watch this pole and wiggle around these trees. Got to make a super wide turn here. I don't think we're gonna even make this turn. I don't think I went wide enough. Uh oh, cops coming! Oh, they're chasing a freaking tipper truck, dump truck. Oh, we may be okay. We may be good. Oh, I'm gonna be close to this pole here. Let's just back it up a bit. Alright, I think we're good. I think we're good. Yep, we're good. Alright, I guess we're just going to take this way in. 
I kind of hit the curb a little bit there. All right, we're just going to go over it because this next turn is going to be a really challenging one. Oh, crap. And we're going to have to make one last turn here, guys. One more. One more. I think I overshot this a little bit. And that should get us in there. Ah, you really feel the weight of this boat as well as your... <laughs> this guy's still drunk. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. That's another mod that does that, another call out. I forgot which call out it is, but it makes heads get drunk and stuff like that. Alright, so let's deploy this last one into the water. Try not to hit these lights. Oops, I right, hit that light right there. Let's just straighten it up again. So you guys, after this, we're going to go ahead and take the Defender out on the water and do a little patrol and see what see what happens, see what we get. I have nothing really planned for this, so I'm just going to go out and see what other, whatever call-outs we get. Alright. Oh, it's going. Okay, good. It stayed. Getting this one out is a little tricky because this thing is so low. Sometimes you got to have to back back it up and pull forward a couple times. Looks like we got it though. Uh, where could we even park this thing at? Alright, there we go. See, so, yeah, this was a perfect spot because now it is out of the way. Oh my god, seriously? <laughs> I didn't realize I was that far over. I thought I had some more space. Oh well. That's what we have taxes for. Ah, there we go. That's a really good actually parking space. It fit really well there. Alright guys, so yeah, let's go ahead and jump into the Defender boat. Let's actually um change our uniform as well. Let's pull out our... Let's see, let's go with this here. Um, I guess we'll just leave this response boat medium there since we're not going to really use it. Ah, dang it, I missed. Let's look at that gun though. Let's look at the detail on Let's check it out really quick. Wow, that looks awesome. That looks really cool. That looks nice. Alright, let's go back over here. I might also go available for calls now. So that dispatch will start giving us some calls. Uh, see if we can head onto the water, try out the new boats, see how well the flags look out there. Also guys, I really do hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, you guys know what to do. Hit that like button. Leave some comments. Subscribe as well. We are rocking our way up to 182,000 subscribers, which is awesome guys. Damn, a little bit farther than I want to be. Alright, that should be okay right there. Alright, so let's um let's just anchor it. And we're gonna go ahead and get into the defender now. If you guys have any other ideas for other episodes, definitely let me know by dropping dropping your idea in the comment section as well. Alright, so let's go ahead and get our defender going. Let's go ahead and unanchor this one. We have lights on it like I was showing you guys. We have our blue emergency lights. We have our siren. We also have those white those uh, lights on top. You can't really see it during daytime, but it's flash right now. You could turn those on and off, plus the ones on the side as well. So that really helps light up light up the area, especially at night or in low visibility. So man, this boat looks awesome. I think my favorite boat. I don't know. I really like the response boat medium, but at the same time, I love how fast we can get around with the defender boat, you know? I probably shouldn't be going this fast out of here, so let's slow it down just a little bit. But I just really want to watch the the flag wave in the wind there. It looks pretty cool. Alright, so we're out on the beach area. We're on patrol. This thing looks sick, man. This looks awesome. Let's 
Let's see if we can find another defender boat with some um, people on it. Cause it would look even cooler with people on it too. Oh, look at that, guys! Look at that. That oh, that that's also part of Coastal Callouts too. Look at the helicopter and the C-130 flying there. Oh, that is awesome, man. We are definitely not catching up to that C-130. That C-130 is gone. Literally, it's gone. <laughs> but wow, that was pretty cool there. That was pretty cool. But yeah, guys, we're going to go ahead and be on duty out here. I'll see if we get any cool calls from this batch. And I'll also look out for anybody that's out here doing anything that they are not supposed to be doing. Let's go around to the front of the ship here. Oh. Let's also cool off in the water because it's so hot outside. Oh, man, this looks awesome. We're manning the gun, guys. We're manning the gun. That looks so cool, man. That looks so cool. All right, so yeah, we'll be out here keeping everybody protected, keeping everybody safe, and we'll see if um, dispatch has anything for us. We are available. All right, let's see what we get, guys. Let's see what we get. Attention, all units. We have a possible 148 off the western coast. Alright guys, we got a report of a fleeing boat. Let's go ahead and respond to that. This should be a good call. We haven't had this call in a while. All available Coast Guard units. We've got a 1099 off the western coast. Respond code 3. Copy that, dispatch. Alright, let's see if we can find this boat that we're looking for. We probably need some backup. Oh, look at that right there. That would be awesome being able to open up that gun on them. Alright, I see another Coast Guard boat responding, guys. There's another Coast Guard boat on scene. Alright, it looks like we're chasing a sailboat. Seriously? Pull your sailboat over. Do you not see our guns? Look at that Coast Guard crew over there in that boat. That's pretty cool. Um, looks like we got a male. He's not stopping here. He doesn't stop. We're going to have to get him slapped somehow. We can't open up. Let's go ahead and give him some warnings here. Nope. <laughs> Look how big the steering wheel is on that thing. not trying to stop guys it's not trying to stop all right let's get a maritime SWAT back up out here those guys are a little bit more heavily equipped than we are oh yeah that's what we need look at that what's on the front there they are heavily decked out there I want to get a closer look. I'm trying to see who, what's that big thing over there. Oh, it's just the model kind of glitching out. Damn, that's awesome, though. I, I want... Oh, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Shit. All right. Let me throw that guy a wreck. A oh, freaking life preserver. Where is he? I got you. We got a man overboard. Man overboard. Man overboard. Where is he? Did he get it? It's like right next to it too. Come on, get it, get it, get it, get it. Take it. Come on, get it. Yo, the freaking car is dragging us. Oh crap, we got two men overboard. Alright, alright, that works. That works. Alright, we got him. He actually fell off the other boat, so we're just trying to help him out there. Should have probably anchored my boat first. Let's put him inside. Alright, he's good now. Alright. Ooh. Alright, let's try to get back to that pursuit. It would have been terrible if we would have just left them there though. Imagine we'd have just kept on driving. Alright, let's go ahead and get 
a little bit more into this pursuit now. Let's get our rifles out. I know I probably have a whole bunch of guns that I don't need, so let me just get a carbine rifle. I'm gonna see if I can take a shot. But you know what we should actually use? Let's use the uh, machine then. This one looks closer to the one that's on the front there. Alright, he's not getting away now. Uh oh. Wait, what happened? What happened to the pursuit? Did we did they catch him? I don't know what happened. I didn't accidentally delete the call, did I? I have to watch back the recording and see what happened there. I don't know what happened. Not sure what happened there. Alright. Here's what it is. Well, anyway, guys, hope you guys did enjoy this episode. Sorry we left you on a bit of a cliffhanger with that one. Not sure what happened there. But um, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy the new boat update. Like I said, let me know what you guys think about it in the um, comment section down below. And also, guys, don't forget to watch the Coast Guard video from yesterday as well. Um, yesterday was a pretty cool episode. We had a really intense rescue. We had a sinking ship that was actually right off of a, right over there actually a couple miles out and it was eight people. We had to locate eight people. We used a cool C-27 aircraft to help locate the people. Uh, airplane which is pretty cool. Look at that. You really get to see the wildlife when you're out here too. It's pretty cool. But um, yeah, guys, definitely check out yesterday's episode. It was awesome. And um, let me know what you think about that one as well. Next Close to Call Outs video will be next week. So let me know what you guys would like to, me to do for next week video. And um, I'll try to make it happen. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.